Hey guys, Peter here to do an album review. Today I'm here to tell you all about the latest album from Cobra and the Lotus Evolution, out September 20th on Napalm Records. This album has 11 tracks, 40 minutes in length, and this is the band's six full length album. Listening to this record, the first thing that I take away from it is that this album does not fit in one genre. It just includes a lot of several influences from different genres, from hard rock, rock, power metal, heavy metal, symphonic metal. There's just a lot of different influences at play that make this re record really dynamic, really fluid, uh, really strong from beginning to end, but at the same time pulling you in a lot of different directions that it's just nearly impossible for you to just pigeonhole this record into one genre and expect the album to carry it all the way through. It's not gonna happen. This album really follows the name of the record, Evolution. This album to me shows the evolution that the band has had over the last two records, specifically over the last two records, and this to me is the culmination of that evolution. It's just the growth of the band. They come out with a different logo for the band. This album has a lot more bite as far as the guitars are concerned. And I'm gonna put it out here, before I even go any further on this album review, I'm gonna say this, Cobra Page put together a performance that in my opinion is one of the best metal vocal performances of 2019 on this record. Absolutely magnificent. I cannot, I, I, I cannot wrap my head around how good her vocals are on this album. They're just absolutely magnificent. So I wanna start off by saying that and really explain afterwards how we how do i got to that but i just wanted off i just really wanted to start off this album review by making that remark because i was really blown away by her voice on this album on every single track she is her strength and her vocals is the glue that unifies this record from the first to the last track because as far as as structure is concerned as far as the dynamics of the record this album is extremely fluid extremely eclectic now Looking at the overall record, we have to break down this record into three components. Structure, vocals, music. Music, and when I mean music, I mean really the guitars. I felt the guitars had a huge uh, role, had a huge uh, piece of the pie as far as the overall sound of this record was concerned. I'm going to start off with the structure. This album has a very balanced yet irreverent structure. Like I said already, every single song feels different. It feels like it pulls from a different influence, pulls from different elements. Overall, the whole record is really tied in together uh, due to the incredible vocal performance of Cobra Page. But each single song feels very unique, very different. This allows the overall structure of the record to be very irreverent, like I said, to, to feel very dynamic, but still feeling very balanced. Like there isn't one song that doesn't feel like it belongs there. All of them really allow... All of them give something to the next song that allows the whole album to just feel concise. Now, this is not an album that gives you ups and downs with peaks and valleys starting really strong, then dipping down in the middle with a ballad and then picking up intensity as it gets towards the end of the record. That's not the style of record that you have here. The intensity of these songs is very equal. While the structure of the song is different, the intensity that they have you that they have and that they give you is very similar. This album really gives you a bumpy ride. So there, there are some peaks and some and some valleys, but not something that's very noticeable, something that really drastic that you really feel like the album is skyrocketing for the first three songs, then it kind of falls on intensity for the next three and then it picks up again. No, it's not the kind of record you have here. This is more of a bumpy ride from the first to the last track with a few elements, a few songs that that, that dip in a few uh, songs that really increase the intensity, but overall is a really very well put together, very concise, uh, 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 an album that just holds itself from the first to the last song. One of those elements, like I said before, and I will continue to say, Cobra Page's vocals really hold this record together. Now, from a guitarist perspective, this album has a serious bite. It has a lot of melody, has a lot of grooviness to it, but it also has a lot of explosion, has a lot of heaviness. So it's an album that really, from a guitarist perspective, is really rich and dynamic. It offers a lot of different elements, it offers a lot of different moving parts, but I really like the, 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 the heaviness that this album has to offer from a guitar perspective. I also like the melody that it has. The combination of the two is really key for an album like this to work. The mixing of the melody with the heaviness, with the aggression, with the power, all of these elements are at play as far as the guitars are concerned. 
and with the vocals those to me are the two driving forces of this record almost like they alternate each other in terms of who's behind the wheel when it comes down to this album last but not least let's talk about the vocals i already said what needs to be said which is to me this is one of the best metal vocal performances of 2019 i mean there's not much else i can add to that this album really showcases her talent absolutely magnificent from the first to the last track how she's able to deliver an incredible performance on every single track even if the tracks have different styles different atmospheres different dynamics diff different influences it doesn't matter she just changes ever so slightly her deliver to really uh, delivery to really get the most out of every single track and to really get the most out of her vocals i was absolutely blown away with how leveled how together her performance was on this album magnificent one for the ages i must say now as far as tracks are concerned i'm going to start off with evolution which is the second track technically the first track on the album but the first track is an intro and, and then that intro bleeds in into this second track evolution a song that to me really has a lot of symphonic elements it has a little bit of a symphonic uh, almost symphonic power metal but more of a symphonic metal bass to it which was a really nice way of getting this album started i really like the fact that they picked this as the the opening track if you will as the second track but the opening track if you will of the record because it's a song that has a lot of bite to the guitars really showcases a lot of the melody and aggression that the guitars have throughout the record uh and it also uh, shows how well those elements those guitar elements work with Cobra Page's vocals how well combined these two elements are this heaviness and melody how intertwined they are throughout this whole track and then obviously throughout the rest of the record so I really like this track I like the feel that it has I like that symphonic uh, orchestration that it has it just gives it this larger than life feel and it's the perfect way to get this album started because it immediately grabs your attention and does not let you go the moment this song plays you are immediately hooked for the rest of the record. It just has this really captivating, majestic, cinematic vibe to it. Perfect blended song as far as melody and heaviness is concerned. Next is Wounds, a song that has a slow buildup. This feels more like a, a, a rock, hard rock song, it, it, and it stays true to that hard rock vibe all the way through. It is a track that has some darker moments. It, it has a building approach towards the verses. The song really feels uh, that it has this throughout the verses it has this just building up approach until you get to the chorus where it's more melodic has a, a little bit it's not as dark as the verses it's a lot more brighter there's a lot more melody to it so I really like that approach I like that that dark evolution that the verses have until you get to that more melodic approach in the chorus it's a song that really has that dynamic built in within it uh, I, it also has my favorite solos on the record I really like what they did here on this song it's just added to the melody it added to the brightness it's just added to the volume that this this song really required because it's not a really heavy song but it has that that hard rock bass line that hard rock spinal cord all the way through that really fits the mood of the song it really fits the atmosphere that the song has it's a song that has a lot of hookiness a lot of catchiness to it it almost feels like uh, at certain points of the song that that hard rock rock vibe almost becomes popish at times and then it, it's almost like a, a a pop rock song that's turned all the way to 11. that's the overall feel that you get from the song it starts a little bit more feeling like a hard rock song and then it kind of blends into more of a rock pop rock track that's really hooky really catchy really melody friendly that has a, a near warm aspect to it and like i said it almost feels like a pop rock song that's turned all the way to 11. that's the overall atmosphere vibe that you get from this track last is wash away that is the ballad on the record perfect blend of acoustic guitars with cobra pages vocals it's the perfect duet there's only one person singing but this song as far as the guitar melody the sound the acoustic guitars the sound that they have and her voice it's the perfect duet between those two elements even when the song this is a song that has a really stripped down effect because of that acoustic uh, guitar sound has a really stripped down feel almost an unplugged feel to it but even when the song becomes a little bit thicker not heavier but a little bit thicker with a little bit more volume it never loses that bare bones feel that it has all the way throughout the track and i really like that that to me was one of the things that captivated me to this ballad it has an incredible chorus really bombastic 
beautiful chorus really pushing the envelope and really pushing more importantly the volume of the song forward and upwards it's a song that in that chorus carries a lot of emotion with it and i really like that combination and, and how it was structured and how it was, was put together incredible orchestration in the background really adds a dark feel to it it adds a little bit of a somber feel to it but that works extremely well with the acoustic guitars and obviously with Cora Page's vocals her vocals on this song are absolutely magnificent they just add so so much emotion to a track that feels like it's packed with emotion you can almost cut it with a knife all right guys this is it this is cobra and the lotus evolution on september 20th on napalm records let me know your thoughts on the band on the singles and on this record use the comment section below as always i will read those and get back to you take care guys